What's up guys, for today's video we're going to do a little experiment that's what we like to do. I got right here $40 of scratch off tickets, $5 each, about what, 8 tickets. And I got right here a Pokemon Paldian Fates. Also $40 on Amazon, some places higher, some places could be even cheaper if they go on sale. But there's 9 packs versus 8 tickets let's see what it's going to take us we're going to i don't know i guess a scratch one open one pack and see what happens okay Paldia fades obviously comes with this right away some value in these books people oops people buy them by itself there's a card holder and right away it comes with the extra value of things like dice and a promo code card this promo by itself is like three dollars they sell though they sell pretty good on ebay um this side here is also by the way could be used or plain deck or um three dollars and they go up in value on um, pack of um what they call energy there's not much value in there but this is what we after it right here one two three four five six seven eight nine nine packs which one do you guys prefer a lot of my subscribers probably will prefer lottery tickets let's go with the pokemon the biggest hit is like hundred and forty dollars um code card and bulk thousand cards for bulk is like what $26 but we're not going to have 1000 cards we only have like 90 cards here okay reverse holo reverse holo oh charizard right away this is only about three to four dollar card so we got one layer hit it's promising also we got bulk and we got hollows so let's keep going one hit versus one ticket so just like that there's bonus numbers Okay, this might be have to zoom in a little bit. Okay, 42, 6, 23, 38, 19, 28, 38, okay, nothing, 30. Oh, we got a winner, five dollars. So we're just getting our money back because the ticket cost five dollars so far. 13, 3, 21. 146 oh this is just bonus numbers okay so in bonus numbers is what okay it goes to here okay 37 nothing 39 41 so we got five dollar win and either way we got it here i'd say uh three to four dollars um card hit but it is a really popular Pokemon so right now we even that's surprising did not expect to get that to where from the first ticket and a pack we are very even pretty much five dollars versus five dollar okay let's keep going pack number two and now it's gonna be ticket number two I'm not including the bulk all this uh, what do you call us code cards I think for ten you can sell it for five bucks each Ooh, another heap hit nice a uh, heap peep i think it's another like three to four dollar card reverse holo reverse holo everything else is bulk let me separate my reverse hollows okay so we got another hit will we get back to back hit on the lottery tickets it happens but let's see this is a fun little experiment let me know in comments below what do you think 40 36, 22, 6, 14, 21, 9, 24, 42. I know making a video, I right the way already feels like way more enjoyable to open up cards than scratching off tickets and make you guys watching that. It's not as fun to me. Okay, bonus. Where is the bonus numbers? 12, 28. 43 from what I see we got so far Pokemon it has more hits because this one is a loser um, then um, scratch offs that's like at least over there seven to ten dollars we already got back let's keep going and again I'm not including bulk 
reverse halos and code cards. Okay, pack number three. Reverse, reverse, and no heat this time, which is pretty normal. We're not gonna have a heat every time. So let's keep going with ladder ticket. I gotta be organized over here. Let's see. 33, 43, 15, 22, 41, 6, 16, 7, 36, 17, 9, 39, bonus, where you at? 23, 12, and 24. Yet another loser, so it's okay. Still kind of tight. I mean, I would say like Pokemon still wins because we get in every time we open in Pokemon cards, we get in at least some kind of value. And there are some really good playing cards for playing deck, like this trainer card, another training card. Ooh, v Victorio. That is only $2 card, it's very common. Behind there, not a double hit. Sometimes there's double hits, but as you can see, uh, the hit side here is pretty often. <sighs> Uh, clean this up so it doesn't get onto my Pokemon card. Also, this scratching off, as you can see, makes a lot of mess. I mean, both fun to each their own. We'll see which one is just does better in return. Okay, 9, 30, 24, 39, 42, 11, 35, 3, 33, 37, 4, 144 and 17 so looks like another another loser so we have right there at least ten dollars value in pokemon we only have out of twenty dollars we have five dollars value back they say it's win but in reality we just got five dollars back so let's keep going see what we get here It's just more fun right here. There you go, Judd. Judge, another hit. That's awesome. I have all those cards. I don't need that for my um, collection set. So it's all going into trade one day. But it is another hit for like what? Two, three dollars at least. That's cool. 21, 40. Ooh, two times. Let's see what that is two times right here. This one, go big, go, go home. Ah, $10. Okay, I'll skip going. Just so far, only $10. That's how it happens. We need 50x. Okay, 43. Let's see. 45, 35, 11, 13. 37, bonus 8, 28, and 36. So we got that here so far, $15 back in value. Let me reset the camera a little bit. So that's it, $15, which is like, I would say so far, maybe a scratch off is bigger return so far, but let's keep going. We haven't hit anything good at Pokemon at all. I mean, Charizard is nice, but nothing over like $5. Ooh, I don't even know that one. Repska, I definitely need that one. Awesome, behind there. And there goes. So there you go. That's a hit. I think it's probably 3 to $5 as well. I need that one, actually. That's going into my binder. That's cool. Okay, let's see, let's keep going. Who will win? It's still kind of tight. I don't know yet. 19, 25, 24, 33, 17, 23, 27, 40, 36, 9, 31, 38, 4, 46. Loser. Okay, keep on going, see what we get.
Let's see. Reverse hollow. Ion reverse hollow is pretty good too. On eBay they sell two dollars each because it's so playable. But anyways, we're not going to count it. We're looking for like full art, EX or better. Okay. 22. 11. 33. 15. 45. 17. 9. 34. 42. 36. 18. 46. 37, 21, 24. Another loser. Let's keep on going. Let's see. Ooh, nice. Palmy. Pretty sure I have that one. Uh, we'll double check. Was behind there? Double hit. There you go. This is only two to three dollar card again, but we got it here five dollars easily, five to six dollars easily in value because we got it here double hit. Awesome. So almost every pack gets a hit. Okay, and the last, last, um, what do you call it? Oh, scratch off, which is how much we put in? 40, we got 15 on the back which is pretty good like that's what this average is right 24 3 22 40 43 nothing 8 34 21 6 23 13 26 11 19 14 another loser but we have one more pack it's nice, it's nine packs because it's a little cheaper. Some sets are way cheaper, some sets are way more expensive. Like, I wish I could find uh, 151, but you know what? It is a little bit more expensive, but you know what? See what? Ooh, another one Iron Thread EX. By far, um, this side here, I wish. Let's see, let's clean up a little bit. I wish I bought two boxes of um, Pokemon instead of getting scratch off tickets and getting $15 back but because instead look at that I got a whole bunch of bulk I got a couple of full arts EXs shinies this and even the most important I got Charizard because the Charizard value going up way higher in value so there it is pretty happy about that what do you guys think in my opinion, I could resell that for way more than $15 uh, um, return. And guess what? We didn't even hit anything good. That's a pretty average hit. I would say actually for uh, lead trainer box, three shinies and each other, we got a really lucky box right here. We didn't get anything super valuable, but Charizard is cool. Five, oh, what is it? 15 mm, I would say right here another five So at least twenty dollars back. I would say easily on eBay prices. I could sell it for twenty dollars pretty easily Versus this stuff we got fifteen dollars back and yeah, I think I'm gonna go cash it in and try more Pokemon's instead, but anyways, that's my opinion. That's what I mean to more maybe you would be rather getting that instead let me know in comments below if you wanted me to try different sets maybe with a hundred dollars maybe with the ten dollar tickets fifty dollar tickets maybe one ticket versus one a whole box like fifty dollar lottery ticket versus um like uh, one um 151 scarlet and violet like eternal box because they both cost 50 that'd be good cool comparison but it's kind of odds are not as good because it's only one ticket versus nine packs I'll try to stick with something similar that is like five dollars per pack five dollars per ticket maybe ten dollars per ticket see what we'll get so hopefully enjoy that video thank you for watching I'm really happy with all these hits actually a lot with the 
a lottery tickets personally i feel like i'm a loser i lost uh more than half of the wallet right here I, i'm actually really happy with this hits and the cool part about pokemon maybe just maybe they go up in valor versus here there's a dead end now now i have to go cash it in versus here i'm enjoying my co collection of hobby just different type of hobbies i still enjoy both but pokemon i do enjoy more i still play lattes once in a while but don't i don't expect too much from it um th anyways that's my experience that's why i like pokemon more than lattes but anyways hopefully we'll do more tests and see what we get